What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be checking out the Pokemon Presents and boy oh boy am I excited. Today we get a look at Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. We get a look at Pokemon Legends Arceus and hopefully some other stuff thrown in. Today on recording we got the update for Pokemon Unite which introduced Blitzy. Kudos on that. I haven't jumped in and tried that yet. However, this Pokemon Presents I'm super excited about. Again, Pokemon Legends Arceus. Hopefully we get more on this game than Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl. I've, I've, I, Brilliant Sh Diamond and Shiny Pearl. I'm excited for but again, to me, feel like another shot at doing remakes. And not that I don't mind the Pokemon, you know, remakes. I feel like they're not, to me anyway, not the highlight of when my Pokemon experiences. I like to play new games. You know, Sword and Shield to me were incredible. Same thing with um, Sun and Moon when those drop. And I, I feel like when they do remakes or like third versions of the game, it kind of is like eh, stretches out the game a little bit too much where I just like the original experiences. I am going to do a, try to do a full playthrough of Brilliant, of just a regular Diamond and Pearl before um, Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl come out. But again, that is if I get enough time to like run through those games. Because you know me, I like to play um, tons of other games as well. Pokemon Legends Arceus, I am very excited about. Because again, this is a whole new idea, a new take, you could say, of Pokemon. And hopefully they show us that. Hopefully they show us that today. Today, they show us and get us impressed with Pokemon Legends Arceus. Not that we're not impressed. I feel like, I, I, I don't want to speak for the whole Pokemon community. But I feel like a lot of people are like wishy-washy on it. While we're excited and hopeful and praying that the game is gonna be in a good state and you know and be this groundbreaking pokemon game that we all gonna you know come to know and love hopefully hopefully i'm praying that they show a little bit of that today give us the confidence rolling into this game and that's all i'm asking brilliant diamond shining pearl we really don't need uh, that much confident boosting with these games i mean we see the art style we see that they are remakes they're trying to keep it as you know much as a reenactment of the DM ds games i wasn't a huge fan of those games just to be up front but i'm gonna try it out i am gonna play it it's a pokemon game of course and it's probably gonna feel like a new experience to me because i don't even remember beating those games i i always say this oh, the pokemon ds games like i remember just like playing it was just a point in my life where i was just playing stuff just to kind of play it i remember just playing like maybe the first two badges i couldn't even tell you the type of the first two badge leaders in that game so i definitely want to go in now with a fresh grown eyes on diamond and pearl so that's why i want to do a playthrough before i actually jump into um the remakes and who knows i probably do a little bit of a playthrough and then jump out of it and wait don't get too spoiled on and play through the remix because i think playing on nintendo switch would probably be better than me playing it on an emulator and stuff like that so don't know what to expect going into this i'm really hoping that we see a lot of pokemon legends arceus again brilliant diamond shining pearl i'm kind of like on the fence they need to sell me more on that to get super excited hopefully they do add new stuff to the game let's see oh no keep it like that Okay, a gangster. Hello, everyone. Hello. First, we'd like to share some news about Pokemon's first strategic team battle game. Okay, Unite. Pokemon Unite. Let's go. We're going to get a mobile update. September 22nd. Okay, let's get this out the way. Players will also receive special gifts. Oh, for pre-registering? Pre let's go, bro. We hope you'll all pre-register and look forward to the mobile release. Let's go. That is fire, bro. Players who are quick to jump in with the Nintendo Switch version that has already been released can also receive Zera Aura's Unite license as a launch bonus. The Unite license can also be used in the mobile version by linking accounts. That is cool. That is cool. And finally, let me fix I'd this. Like to give you all a preview of some of the Pokémon that are slated to join in future updates. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> Man Swine? Okay, that's cool. Probably, I mean, I gotta play before. I gotta um, play before I judge. Sylveon, this has been leaked. I believe Man Swine has been leaked too. I could be wrong on that, but okay. Pokemon Cafe Mix. Reramp. Let's go. Okay. Link and blast puzzle icons. Okay, new dress up options. Okay, years to come. Okay. Pokemon 
Cafe Remix will open its doors this fall. Cafe Remix. I'm down for that. Okay. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> Hello there. So very nice to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Your own tale of Grand Adventure is about to unfold. Okay. Again, very links of, of uh, Awakening lives. Oh, don't do that. Don't zoom in. Don't zoom in. Don't, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> okay. I'm liking it. I'm liking it more. The more I see, the more I want and, you know. Oh, okay. Pokemon following you. Okay. All right. Let's go. Pokemon following you? Yes. I want it. <laughs> That's cool. There's a gym. It's a rock gym. Yeah, this is fire, bro. This is fire. The fights are still Pokemon. Look like Pokemon. Design your Pokeball? Wait, what? Oh my god, okay. Style shop. Okay, you could customize your character. And that's how they look in Overworld. Oh, okay. Cool. Super contest. Okay, alright. Alright, y'all flexing now. Okay. Okay. Explorer's kit. What is this? Is it the first time? Oh, the underground? Okay. Bro, that looks straight out of the 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 DS. Bro, the Pokemon walking around in the overworld? Yes! They are, bro! Oh, shit! Okay! Okay! Now we, we got both, like, integrated with it. Oh, my God. That is fire. Team Galactic. This is the, um... The bad team of the game. Which also could be the uh, bad team of the um, Pokemon Legends Arceus, depending on how that was rolled out. Or the team you're working for. Okay. Okay. Um, this girl, Cynthia. Let's go. Time, space. <laughs> I don't know which one I'm getting. I don't know if I'm getting diamond or pearl. I'll probably get diamond, right? Ooh, let's go. Let's go. That is fire, bro. That is hype. Let's go. Brilliant diamond, shining pearl. Available November 19th. Okay. That trailer was fire. That was a good hype trailer. A lot of new stuff that they adding, I guess, because I don't remember like half of the stuff being there. Shining Pearl is now just three months away. Three months. Let's go. Let's review the main points of these revitalized games. Okay. Let's go. After 15 years, Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl have been reborn into Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl. Okay. This adventure takes place in the Sinnoh region, a land cool. rich in nature with towering Mount Coronet at its heart. As the protagonist, you'll adventure across the region, okay. catching wild Pokemon and making new friends as you strive to complete your Pokedex. Along with your partner Pokemon, you'll overcome the gym leaders of each area and aim to become I'm just like champion. analyzing a lot of the shit that's going on on the screen right now. also encounter traces of the Sinnoh region's myths, passed down through the generations, the Lake Trio. and unravel the truth behind their mysteries. Characters you mean? This is Professor Rowan, who entrusts you with a Pokemon. He's a famous professor researching Pokemon evolution. Okay. This is your childhood friend and rival, 
He hones his Lucas. skills as a Pokemon trainer through your friendly rivalry. Right, that's his name? Form I could be wrong. one of the gym leaders you'll take on during your journey. He uses rock type Pokemon. Everywhere you look, Team Galactic is up to something. Team Galactic, I don't like the hairstyles, bro. Some sort of lofty goal behind all their audacious activity. Team Galactic. Cynthia the is homie. investigating myths about Pokemon. The gangster. She's a mysterious person who shows up at many points along your journey. Oh, we know. We know. <laughs> Gameplay features from Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl have been revamped and powered up for these new games. Yeah. Was this always a thing? The Pokeball? You can participate the added Pokeball thing? Activities, such as digging up fossils or creating your own secret base and decorating it with Pokemon Secret statues. base. I haven't heard that in a while. Secret there base. There are also places down there called Pokemon Hideaways, which didn't exist Pokemon. in Pokemon Diamond okay. and Pokemon Pearl. Apparently... The Pokemon that appear in the Pokemon hideaways will change depending on which statues you have placed in your secret base. Oh my god. The Pokemon living in the Sinnoh region can only be found in this place. Oh, so be sure to fully wow. explore the grand underground spread out beneath the surface of Sinnoh. That is fire. I like that. I like that. I like that. I like you that. You can use the stickers you'll collect on your adventure to customize the effects that appear when Pokemon spring out of Pokeballs. <laughs> such as confetti or fireworks. Confetti, okay. stickers at various locations along your journey and decorating with them, you can make your Pokemon battles even more fun. That's cool. I like that. One That's cool. One feature that was not available in Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl yes. is the ability to change your outfit. Thank your you. Styles on your adventure. Thank you. That is fire. In super contest shows, your Pokemon super can dance contest to the shows. Of the music, proudly show off a contest move, and aim for a successful show. Cooperate with your partner Pokemon to really work up the crowd. Okay. In I dig the it. Union Room. This release allows you to use not only local communication, but also online communication okay. to interact with trainers all over the world in real time. Please enjoy battles and Pokemon trades with many other trainers. Super clean, super clean. You can walk around with any of the Pokemon bro, that appear in these games. That is enjoy fire, your bro. Through Sinnoh together with your partner Pokemon. That is fire. <laughs> Get me. Encounters with all kinds of people and Pokemon and the mystery behind Sinnoh's myths await you. Okay, so no new Pokemon. We hope you look forward to starting an exciting no, adventure um, with new gameplay features in the Sinnoh region. New Sinnoh um, forms. No new Megas. No new like Z moves. Anything. For the start of your adventure. Okay, that's cool. But that's not all. A special Nintendo Switch Lite, Dialga, and Palkid. Oh no! <laughs> Show us! Show us! This special Nintendo Switch Lite is dressed up with art of the legendary Pokemon. Why is it Nintendo, Nintendo Switch Lite though? Oh Nintendo my god. Ooh, that looks clean. Oh, so it looks like. Oh, wow. Look forward to it. Bro, sold out immediately. Next, <laughs> we have some information for you about the Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go. Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let's go. <laughs> oh my god. Cyndaquil. Rowlet. I don't even know his name. What? He could throw that off? <laughs> I thought that was attached to his belly. Let's go. Let's go. This is a tell long time ago the humans and Pokemon were separated. Okay, but oof. Art style still looking wishy washy. It's still looking like wild area. Like back walking back and forth instead of just like living more so like Pokemon Snap raised the bar for like how Pokemon looking overworld. Oh my god. Let's go, bro. Is that dealing? Why is it white? 
Oh! Bro! Yo, what the f- Who, who, who? Okay. Oh my god, yes. This is what I'm talking about. Them sleeping and like living in the environment. Oh my god. Oh, you miss. Oh, but they want to fight. Who's that? What Pokemon is that? That's a Growlithe? Bro, look at that Growlithe, bro. What? Was that a firecracker that went off? Oh my god, yes, 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 yes. Oh, yes, bro. Look at oh, let's go, bro. What is he swimming on? What are you swimming on, bro? Why? <laughs> Why is that in that color scheme? Like, all white like that, bro? What is going on? You seen the way the camera was, like, moving with it, too? It was, like, locked on so far away. Beautiful. Okay. Oh, he is... Okay, what is going on? Okay. Why... Oh, run, bro! <laughs> run! Okay, the screen had an effect when you got hit, bro. Oh my god. So we do get regular style Pokemon battles. Oh my god. You can catch these Pokemon with red eyes, okay. What is going on? Why do they have the... Oh, okay. Look at Growlithe, bro! What's on his head? <laughs> Don't freeze now, bro! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Not actual gameplay footage? Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh my god, look how beautiful this looks, bro. Okay, all right. January 28th! They doubling down on a January date! Okay! I thought we were gonna get a delay. That was the latest trailer for Pokemon Legends Arceus. Let's go, bro! That is fire, bro. Let's take a closer look at some of the elements introduced in Yes, 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 yes! Let's go, bro. Pokemon Legends Arceus is a brand new title that opens new doors for the Pokemon series by Bro, look at Growlithe! Elements. Bro! Your adventure takes place in a region known as Hisui, during a long ago era when it was rare for people to live in harmony alongside Pokemon. Mount Coronet towers over the center of the land, with sprawling, diverse, natural environments surrounding the mountain on all sides. These Hero different cross. areas are home to a rich variety of Pokemon ecosystems. In okay. the future, this land of Hisui will come to be known as the Sinnoh region. Okay. You'll set out on an adventure with the goal of completing bro. the first ever Pokedex for the Hisui Look at region. this, bro! My god, let's go! The bustling Jubilee village will be the base oh for Oh my god. It's home to the Galaxy Expedition Team, made up Galaxy of from Expedition other Teams. With divisions such as the Medical Corps, the Security Corps, and the Survey Corps, which researches Pokemon. Okay. Professor Laventon's field of study Professor is the of Pokemon. He came okay. to the Hisui region along with Pokemon he met in various other regions. He entrusts region. one of these Pokemon to you. I mean, who do we do? Captain Silene is the leader of the <laughs> do Survey Corps. Do we do Cynequil? Corps, she may seem to treat you harshly, 
Deep down, she's your biggest supporter, and she watches over your progress with care. Okay, that's cool. Commander Komodo oversees the entire galaxy this, team. This is the bad guy, right? He's a capable leader who has <laughs> earned the unwavering trust of his team members. When the commander Probably recognizes not. your knack for Pokemon research, he allows you to join the team and has you work as a member of the Survey Corps. Okay. The duty of the Survey Corps is to observe and catch Pokemon to shed light on how they live. Oh your my survey god. survey duties hold the key yes. to unlocking the true purpose of your adventure. And in the course of your work, you'll visit various locations within the Hisui region. Your excursions outside the village will begin by preparing at a base camp. At these camps, you'll be able to prepare for your base survey camps. work by buying items or crafting new ones from basic materials. Okay. Buying crafting system. You'll find that you'll be vulnerable to attacks from wild Pokemon. Okay. Take too much damage from their attacks, and you'll black out. So what? When you're out doing your so you could get attacked? If Pokemon are hurt. You can return to a base camp to rest up and recover. What? Once you've a survey assignment, return to the village and report the results to whoever requested the job. Can whoa wow! They don't even know. They don't even Pokemon know. live all over the place. Get close to them and aim carefully, then throw a Pokeball to try to catch them. Yo, you really have to aim. Some species of Pokemon react the same way when they spot you. For example, some Pokemon will immediately flee, so you'll want to hide in tall grass when you approach them. Aggressive oh. Pokemon, on the other hand, may need to be weakened in battle. There are a variety oh. of tricks to catching them all. Oh, let's go, bro! Containing one of your own Pokemon near a wild Pokemon, and a battle will begin. Okay. You'll find that a single Pokemon may get to act multiple times in a row, depending on its speed stat and the moves that it uses. Okay. It used to have Pokemon use their moves in two different styles: strong style and agile style. Using a move in the strong style will increase the move's power, but the Pokemon's okay. action speed will be lowered. Using a move in the agile okay. style will decrease the move's power, but the Pokemon's action speed will be raised. You'll find the strong oh, style okay. will come in handy when you see a chance to end a battle with one powerful move. While the oh, agile okay. style is great for situations where acting multiple times in a row will give your battle strategy a real boost. Let's fucking go, these bro. Different styles Let's the fucking situation go. situation demands to gain the upper hand in battle. Pokedex. When you report the results of your survey work to the professor, information will be added to the Pokedex. Okay. You can advance your research and fill in more information by doing things like catching Pokemon, seeing them use certain moves multiple times, and more. Seek out and meet lots of different Pokemon to complete that. Bro, let's go. Look at the world, bro. Jesus Christ, this looks fire, bro. Well, we'd like to introduce some of the Pokemon living in the rich natural yes. that are spread out Come on. the Hisui region. Come on, the let's go. Distinctive antlers is known as Weirdeer. Weirdeer? Weirdeer evolves from a Stantler that has managed to live oh, in the evolution. environment of the Hisui oh. region. It has strong ties with the local people, and it has been treated with great care and respect in this land oh, since ancient new times. New Pokemon, bro. Garment new Pokemon, bro. From its beard, tail, and legs are highly prized as warm winter clothing. This Pokemon is Basculegion. Basculegion. Great power. Basculin that live in the Hisui region can evolve into this Pokemon if they become possessed by the restless souls of other Basculin in their school that have perished during their journey upstream. This what? Pokemon Jesus power Christ, from what? Possessing it, letting it swim on and on. Power from the souls there possessing. Are also Pokemon that can be found living in this land in forms that have adapted to the Bro, look at Growlithe! This Pokemon with its great majestic wings is the Hisuian form of Braviary. It comes to Hisui in the winter and can imbue its screeches with psychic power to generate Oh, shock psychic waves. too. Let's fucking go. That's this fire. Pokemon, which works with a Look at Growlithe! <laughs> no. It is a very wary Pokemon and appears to protect its territory. Let's Hisui go. Soft fur is an excellent insulator, allowing it to stay active and lively even in this chilly land. The horn on its head is made of rock, but it breaks easily. Oh, so Hisui, it's rock fire. It only when it'll have the greatest effect. Okay, I could have guessed that. Rock fire. Pokemon they always put fire and rock together on fine ground. But what connection does it have to your adventure? 
We hope you look forward to finding out on the day when you can finally meet the people in Pokemon. Yes, I can't wait. For yourself. I can't wait, bro. Let's go. Those were our latest updates on these new entries in the Pokemon series. Oh, okay, cool. Pre-orders for Pokemon nice. Legends Arceus, mm -hmm. Pokemon Brilliant Diamond, and Pokemon Shining Pearl are coming Friday. Available on Nintendo eShop after this broadcast. Oh, okay, cool. We'd also like to announce that support for these titles is planned to come to Pokemon Home, the cloud service for Nintendo yes. compatible mobile devices in 2022. Yes, give us that music. I love that Pokemon Home music. Let's go, bro. So people won't bring over the battles that so many of you continue to enjoy. These will take place as before in Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. Okay. Have fun participating in even more Rank battles will play not play take future. place in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. It will not. These are all the latest updates we can share with so you. So we staying with We hope you're looking forward to all the exciting Pokemon adventures to come. I kind of wish they like Thank you know you all for tuning in and watching. That's cool. That's cool though. Cool, thank you. Head bow, is that it? Yep, that's it. We got credits. We got credits. Wow. Bro, we got a whole lot, bro. A whole lot to go over. Shit, bro. I'm not gonna go over this stuff um in the beginning. Cause it was just like Pokemon Master stuff, Pokemon Unite stuff. Boy, I am blown away on how much they're how good that they're treating this game. I initially thought Cash Grab remakes are next, obviously. Let's just do it. Art style, let's just give them any art style that's cheap. And that's why we chose this. This is looking more like, oh no, we chose this because it looks like the DS games. And that's what we want to give you. And boy, oh boy, this shit looks fire, bro. I am super excited for these now. Because I kind like I, I kind of hate when Pokemon does this. Where they would introduce something new and then take away from it. Like, this art style looks so good. I want I want Gen 3 like this. I want Gen 2 like this. I want Gen 1 like this. In this art style where it's it, it, it looks like better versions of the same game, you could say. And I don't know. I, obviously, we're not going to get Gen 1, 2, 3 like this. Um, and that's a bummer to me. I think... Even in them doing the next games um, after this, I think they might even switch the, the art style up again. You know what I'm saying? This doesn't look like Let's Go Pikachu. It doesn't look like Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. And I'm cool with that. I'm very cool with that. Just the overall like blood, sweat, and tears it looks like that went into this game, um, remake is, to me, it's like, oh my god. I can't wait. I can't wait. It's so much stuff. It's literally so much stuff. I'm going to do a whole video talking about um brilliant diamond and shining pearl um from everything that's new from the trailer so i'm definitely gonna work on that and then this oh my god oh my god oh my god oh my god pokemon legends arceus looks like it doesn't to me I'm gonna keep it honest. It doesn't look 10 times better or, you know, the ground, like, no. But what it does answer is that the, the, the questions I have about the Pokemon. In this shot, it, it, that looks disappointing. This looks disappointing. Just the Pokemon walking, like, back and forth. It looks like on a track and not really, like, living in the environment. I don't like when they do that. I, I would like them to approach it more in a uh, Pokemon Snap type of vibe where it looks like the Pokemon are living in the world. And we do see some of that. Um, I don't I don't know if the, um, is, is, if I can find it. But there's a, a, a scene in here where it showed the Pokemon sleeping. And then the trainer was walking up to it and it started waking up. That is the stuff, more stuff I want them to lean more towards. But it looks like we're getting like halfway of that. And I think we're going to see some of that here. Like this, like... It noticing that a Pokemon or some like noise was happening or stuff like that. And I, I, I'm cool with that. What I'm not cool with is just like the Pokemon just standing in the middle out in the open for no reason. And it, it kind of lose the charm or like the the like the the feel of you in a real world with this Pokemon. While uh, as in Pokemon Snap, granted that's just a picture taking game. We do see the Pokemon living, you know what I'm saying? Eating. 
we see them interacting with each other. You know what I'm saying? Riding each other's backs. Like, stuff that you will never see in a traditional Pokemon game. I hope those, you know, animations and that vibe potentially makes its way into um, traditional Pokemon games. And that that's all I'm asking for. It's a half step here, but a cool half step, um, you know, nonetheless... The stuff that we did see today with Pokemon Legends Arceus, as far as all these new Pokemon, these um, new forms, new ways to get around the world, you know, the city and stuff like that. The story being broke down, all hype stuff. I can't wait for more. It, it This kind of feels like the, the first showing of Pokemon Legends Arceus and Brilliant Diamond and Shiny Pearl. I feel like the first time... We've seen them. It was just teases, if anything. Because we didn't see anything. <laughs> like, before this, before this, we didn't see or know anything about these games. Now, a lot of the questions are being answered. And to me, they're all good. Everything is going up. Um, um Let me wrap this up. If I had to... I, will, I don't like giving um, trailers um, a score. If it's, like, plus 30 minutes, it's, it's, it's ridiculous to do that. Um, especially in trailers like this where they're breaking down so much stuff. they answering all the questions that I, I would have from watching the trailer. So, of course, I would grade them perfect, you know, trailers or whatever. But this is definitely great stuff. Great, 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 great trailers. Um, nonetheless, with Brilliant Diamond and, um, um, Shiny Pearl and then with Pokemon Legends Arceus. They did fantastic work. Um, let me know what you think of these trailers and this Pokemon Presents in the comment section below. Like always, guys, I answer all comments, so let's have that conversation down there. If you're new around here, consider hitting that subscribe button. I do videos like this every day, talking Pokemon, Mario, Fortnite, Call of Duty, whatever I feel like dropping the vibes on, I drop it here on the channel. So again, consider hitting that subscribe button. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to. Join the family. Ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos. As well as hit the like button on this video so it can be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok, or whatever i'm daddy gamer fred on all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest. I am a variety channel. I do tons of stuff, tons of Pokemon, but tons of other stuff as well. So dive into these videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.